7,000 subscribers, 1.1 million views. Thank you everyone for joining my live last night and let's get back to reacting. Steph came out with a video and I was going to react to it. I don't want to talk anymore. Let's get to it. Let's get it. What's up y'all? So by now y'all probably already seen the video that I put out and y'all done seen Laura's response to it. You sure did. I'm not did. gonna sit here and even react to her video, honestly, because I feel like her video was very much just her trying to, I'm not even trying to justify. It was kind of pointless in my opinion. It was just <laughs> I her agree. saying that she was single. And I agree. She didn't really say much in the video. So I'm not gonna sit here and react to that video because- Thank you. We all thought that way. Honestly, and, and really nothing that she said. As y'all can see, she's mad that I brought it to the internet. But why did I bring it to the internet in the first place? Y'all see how she reacted on the video. Is how she reacted in real life. It's like talking to a freaking brick wall. Like, it's just like, it ain't nothing mattered to her, I feel like. Talking to her was like talking to a brick wall. And I've obviously, like, I was just kind of fed up with it. I'm, I'm tired of everything seeming like it's like cool and peaches and cream and stuff like that. I've been holding on to that shit for so long. And I'm not about to sit here and keep pretending that shit's cool. Like, clearly, y'all see how she reacted. It was very, like, I don't give a fuck type of vibe. And that's what it is in, in, in real life. She don't got much to say but point the finger and say she was single and pretend like it, it, it just, I wasn't gonna care. The point of the matter is, this shit is disrespectful, bro. We're barely broken up. Yeah, shit was happening prior to that and whatever, whatever, but we're literally under the same roof. If you were so single- Well, my, I... my question is, are you guys still under the same roof? Still to this day, or do you guys live separately now? I'm still trying to catch up onto their story. Catch you in the middle of the night. Like, why did I have to, like, basically sneak up on you? You feel me? It's, the point of the matter is that it's disrespectful. Make it make sense. Like, why would I not care? Why would I just, just be like, okay, hey, girl, that, you're, that, that, that my ex is talking to. Okay, so... I have two things that I want you to cover in this video, Steph, because I have a lot of questions. I want you to cover that story about that throuple. How did it happen? What happened? In detail. Let us know. Okay? Let us know. Other thing I want you to cover is that boo you had. Okay? Because apparently Lauren was not the only one. You had a little side chick slash man. I don't know which gender it is. doesn't matter. But those two things. Let's talk about those things. Real. Then she had the decency to link with the girl twice while I'm not around. But the whole time it was, I'm single, I'm single, I'm single. So basically just, if that shit was done to her, I just want to know, like, if it was done to her, how would she feel? At no point in time did she put herself in my shoes at all. Well, I thought that, but I heard her say that you also had somebody and she didn't act that way. So I guess when the, when she was in your shoes, it didn't matter. <laughs> so, I don't know. Don't try to be even understanding. Is everything is pointing a finger, I was single, I, I don't know she would react like that, blah, 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 blah. But at no point in time do you put yourself in my shoes and say, damn, like, if this was done to me, I would feel this type of way. Like, I'm not just some random girl, bro. So how would you think I was not gonna, like, how did you think I was gonna react? How did you think I was going to react? But, but was, Steph, she can't assume, though. She can't assume those things, regardless. Because apparently she didn't care when you were talking to somebody. She probably thought you were going to react the same way. So both of y'all assumed a lot in this relationship. That's where y'all failed. Communication, man. To you? That's to simple. You, like, how would you react? Think about that shit for a second. When I, when, when, when I make decisions, I sometimes think like, how would I feel in this situation? Right. If this was me, how would I feel? Right. Or at least try to see it through. Like, why, why did I react like this? That's what I do as well. I always consider my partner's feelings, which is why I'm single, okay? Because I don't want to consider nobody's feelings right now. But when I am in a relationship, I don't want to do things 
that's gonna hurt her. Especially things that I know if she did would hurt me. Some people are just selfish, you know? People just care for their temporary good feelings at the moment. Whatever it may be. But I guess she was just so far gone and so emotionally not there that she just thought it, she was cool. Like, I, I would not care that she was in the, ho in the same house that I'm in, talking to a whole other female, even linking with the person and think I'm just gonna be like the whole time, like, yeah, oh my God, do your thing. <laughs> Be for real. And not only that, she wanna she wanna say, oh, I don't know how they agreed to do the throuple thing. Like, I, it was just a joke. It was just a joke. It was a joke. It was a joke. That's what you're gonna say that it was a joke. But it was really you was hiding the truth behind a joke. Cause why would you say it in the first place? Exactly. And you not only that, but it could have initially started as a joke, not expecting what your response to it or the other girl's response and since both of y'all were down she could have just stopped it right there say no you guys i'm just joking but no she followed through with it you guys all met up she got this together she flew that person in and did this little meetup so no bitch you were not joking no ma'am see how i was gonna react you wanted to see if i was gonna say okay cool yeah let's do it and if i did and they were gonna be like oh yeah i'm just kidding so you basically come up with this joke of, oh, like, would you act, like, would you be in a relationship, like a throuple with her? <laughs> because you wanted to see how I was going to react. And my dumb ass, of course, because I'm going to say my dumb I'm ass. I'm glad you I'm, know. I'm, 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 I'm going to take the, the... I'm glad the, you the, know. See, listen, I don't judge throuples, polys. I don't judge none of that stuff. Whatever makes you happy. Is, love is love. But you, Steph, like, I can't picture you in that type of relationship. And, and if it's something that you've never considered before, why do it? It's okay to try it. Maybe you will like it. But you tried it and you didn't like it. So, no, no. No more. Blame for this shit because, yeah, I low-key didn't want to lose her. And I was like, okay, well, maybe adding a third, you know, we'll add spice to the relationship. We'll bring something back. Blah, 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 blah. It'll be something new, something different for us. So, why not? So, I compromised. Okay, well... I don't want to lose her. That's sad. She is clearly fucking with the girl. So why not just be all in this together, right? That was my mentality. And that was stupid as hell because clearly <laughs> that went left. See, that's so sad when when your reason to why you make the, these decisions in your relationship is to not lose them. That right there is already a problem. There's nothing that you can do to try to change this person's mind other than both of you working at it. Both of you have to be in it to win it, put in the work, and it might work out. But for only you to do something just to make her happy only and to sacrifice your happiness, that's a problem. You can make decisions for your relationship to where both of you can compromise and both of you can be happy. If the only reason is to not lose them, you're going to lose them regardless. But she's going to sit there and act like, oh, I don't know why they would do that. Oh, <laughs> like, it was just a joke. No, you knew exactly what you was doing when you did that. And you knew that the girl would be down for it because what does she have to lose? Nothing. So, of course, you knew we both was going to be down for it because we both, she fucking with you, obviously. I don't want to lose you. So we're both fucking with you. So, of course, we're going to do that shit for you. For you. That shit's crazy. <laughs> don't, act, don't sit here and act like, oh my God, I don't know why. No, you know exactly why they did it. You know exactly why you made that joke in the first place. That was your plan all along. You want to have your cake and eat it too. You want to have the best of both worlds. But am my dumb ass? And, I, and it's true. If I love myself more, I probably wouldn't have done that shit. I'm going to admit that shit. If I love myself more, I would not have agreed to that shit. But at the time... I was just like, bro, I don't want to lose her. Let me just do, do this shit and, and see where it goes. And maybe, just maybe, it'll go right. But like I said in my, in my previous video, I really wasn't fucking with the girl. And it had nothing to do with jealousy. It had nothing to do with whatever. It was simply I did not end up clicking with, like, I didn't like her like that. Like, Explain. She was cool and all, but I wasn't, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say it, I wasn't physically attracted to her at all. Oh, was she a femme? All. I'm guessing she's a femme. I don't know what type of um, women Lauren is only into. She could be into studs too. I don't know. And I know looks ain't everything. And sometimes you have to try to look past. No, I, I couldn't look <laughs> past the fact that I just wasn't attracted to her physically. And that's okay. Was I attracted to her and like, oh yeah, she's cool. Like we kind of like the same things. Like she's a cool person as a friend. Like I would not, like I just wasn't on that level of attraction. 
it might honestly i'm gonna admit it could have been maybe different if i was attracted to her maybe if i was attracted to her it would have actually worked out but i just wasn't mm. like i just wasn't attracted to the girl so this shit didn't work out and I, girl it wouldn't it would have never worked out i promise you that if you're already getting jealous with lauren already talking to somebody else imagine all three of you under the same roof if lauren gives her more attention than you you're going to get jealous. You're still going to feel replaced. You're not that type of girl. This is not your type of relationship. I'd much rather we both met the girl at the same time instead of you already fucked with her. Right. Now I'm just going to be in there too. No, it's like easier. I'd much rather everything been organically. Like we meet the person, whatever, whatever. Mm -hmm. But she knew exactly what she was doing when she did that. So don't try to act like, oh, I didn't know. No, you knew exactly what she was doing. And then on top of that, you want to bring up the fact that, oh, well, what she didn't tell y'all was that she lived with a dude. Okay, here's the second part I want to hear about. You touched briefly on that throuple. Okay, I don't forgive you for that. But you gave us a little bit more details. So I guess it is what it is. Now the second topic, let's go. I didn't care. You literally did not care. I didn't go and link with the dude multiple times i didn't go doing anything with him i didn't kiss him i didn't have any relationship relations with him i didn't do none of that shit. and that was literally after you already done linked with the girls Damn. guys and did all that mm, mm, mm. and you knew about it and what did you have to say what did you have to say you want to do what you got to do like you didn't care bro <laughs> Lauren's ready it's, to move on. It wasn't on. affecting you. It wasn't hurting you. It wasn't shocking to you. You literally was like, okay, do what you got to do. It didn't, it, it, it literally didn't affect you. So don't try to... You can't get mad at her for not getting upset about it. I think Lauren's just ready to move on. <laughs> She's literally annoyed that Steph doesn't get the fact that she was single. Okay, she's annoyed by it. Ugh, just let Lauren go. It's time. You're not like, oh, well, this is what she did. Like, you take no accountability at all. None. It's like no part of her is like, damn, like, yeah, I should have probably waited till we wasn't living together. Damn, I should have had more respect for somebody that I've been with for five years that I have a whole freaking kid with. Yeah, maybe I should have just, you know, I don't know heal i mean i guess you didn't need to heal clearly heal or maybe spend some time by yourself before trying to jump into something with somebody else like, girl it's time to let that shit go now like from my understanding it's been months since that happened i know it's your first time talking about it i get it but who cares okay you both decided to just not be together let that shit go it's time just co-parent under okay. different roofs of that i don't i really just don't get it she was wrong all she had to keep saying was that she's single she was single she was single she's gonna hold that shit over his her head for the rest like, of her life blah 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 it's like what i said in that video went in one year and literally out the other and then she want to get mad talking about, I brought it to the internet. I brought it to the internet. Why would I do this? You're, I'm a private person this. I'm a private person that. Lauren, you guys have the login information to your YouTube channel. You could have just deleted it. Because you guys are not deleting these videos, this is probably all fake. Most likely they're not. And I noticed the pattern too. You guys post a video every other day. I think because when you post a video, you wanted to give it two days for the views to go up before you post the other one. I, don't know, I could be wrong, but we're going to play along as if it's real because we still don't know. Bullshit, bro. You're just mad because now people see. Now people see it for what it is. I don't care that I brought it to the internet because at the end of the day, that shit was literally eating me alive, y'all. This shit was literally tugging on my freaking spirit like I, this shit just was bringing me down because it's like bro i'm not gonna sit here and and act like everything is just so peaches and cream and shit didn't go the way it went because it did and like i said i wanted to be transparent with people because at the end of the day we as humans we're not fucking perfect right relationships go through stuff i'd rather show the real than show this 
Oh, pieces and cream. Oh, yeah. Everything's cool. We co-parent. Blah, 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 blah. No, bro. This, the reality is that this is what happened. I felt the way I felt. And I get it. She was mentally, emotionally, whatever, checked out from the relationship. And still is. But at the end of the day, have some fucking respect, bro. Have some respect. I would have never done that shit under the same roof. Under the same motherfucking roof. Thinking that, that, that I was just not going to care. Of course I'm going to freaking care, bro. I didn't spend five years in a relationship to, to just be nonchalant about shit. Yes, I care, bro. And you think I would, like, if it was you, would you not care? If it was the other way around and you were seeing that shit with your own motherfucking eyes, you wouldn't take that as disrespect? Like, come on now. But that's all. Like, I'm not going to keep rambling about the situation. Like I said, I wasn't going to sit here and try to react to a freaking 40-minute <laughs> video of her going around in circles. Right. Not saying much. Yeah, that was a waste of my time. Just saying I was single. Facts. Nothing more. Like, it wasn't really nothing to even sit here and, and say anything about. I'm so with you, girl. Clearly, as y'all can see, this is the shit that, I, that that frustrates me. This is the shit that you said about. So it's like, bro, do you even care? This you know, in my last care? video, I said I would never hook up with someone like Lauren because of her communication skills. I wasn't clear with that. I was in a relationship with someone like Lauren with that bad communication skills. And because of that, I don't ever want to be with someone like that again. It was very frustrating. I'm speaking about my ex-wife. It was very difficult. She would not talk about her feelings. She would not let me know if something, something bothered her. I had to always assume. And a lot of the times I would assume wrong. So I'm do, doing all this extra action to try to fix things and try to make things work with her sitting there as a mute. That was so difficult to go through. So never again. And even if you don't care anymore, at least have some fucking respect, bro. Like, why? Like, I don't understand. This shit just don't make no fucking sense to me. That, that that's, that's where we're at. Like, and yeah, she could say, oh, she bought it to the internet. And now she's just weird between us. She's just not cool. But I don't even care anymore. I really don't. I'm just, like, so over it. It's just, like, fuck it. And it is what it is. I wasn't going to sit here and make this long-ass video reacting to her shit because it was just pointless. But I'm going to come back and say my piece because. Okay, so let's leave it at so, that. It's I'm done. not really nothing else to say at right. all. So. That was Steph's piece. Hopefully they leave it at that because there's no points. They're both on separate pages. They're never going to get it. Neither of them. Do not go back together, you guys. Just co-parent. Do your thing. All right, you guys. That's it for today's video. Like, comment, share, subscribe. See y'all in the next video. Peace.